Hello YouTube, welcome to Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works. It is I, Bandon Wendy, your Saturday vlogger. Got a really great question tonight. And it's all about what does Proof WLS Works mean to you? Mean to me? Would love to see some response videos from the community on this one. So, first part of the question, what does Proof WLS Works mean to me? How much time do we have here? Um, it means so much. Freedom, opportunity, struggle, choices, decisions, angst, frustration, happiness, privilege, thriving. Yeah. Making it the best out of your future. Letting go of the past and being able to see past the past. Creating what is next. What is next? Standing in a moment, multiple moments, and doing what you know is right, right now. Exchanging habits. Realizing that the way I did things in the past wasn't working for me. Adjusting and creating new ways of living. Starting at one weight. My highest weight was 269 pounds back in 2005. By the time I chose to have weight loss surgery in 2009, I had lost some weight and I weighed 244.6 pounds. I had a goal. My goal was to lose 99 pounds. I elected to have lap band surgery, March 23rd, 2009. 68 weeks later, I met my goal weight, 145.6. Check, 99 pounds had been shed, right? Was that proof weight loss surgery works to me? Not quite. For me, it was being able to keep the weight off. Now, I had lost that same 100 pounds three times in my adult life, never able to keep it off. The longest I'd ever kept any amount of weight off was about a year and a half. July 2012, I got my proof. I kept the weight off. No regain. First time ever. Checked it off. Proof weight loss surgery works for me. Something else that comes with everything I just talked about. I'm not sure if it was standing in a place and admitting to myself I was obese, that I no longer had the strength, the ability, the energy to do it alone, and that I needed to have weight loss surgery. Or if it was having to call my parents, talk to my friends, my family, my coworkers, and share with them my decision to have weight loss surgery. Or maybe it was that pre-op liquid diet and all those pre-op tests and the fact that I needed to shrink my liver. Or maybe it was the fact that I surgically altered my body to change. Or maybe it was the fact that I was given a list of rules on a piece of paper, operating instructions, if you will, that came with my lap band. These rules are the rules to success. For weight loss surgery. Follow these rules, you'll be successful. Proof 
weight loss surgery works? Individuals control all of that. I control all of that. But there's something that that weight loss surgery tool does for me. It gave me hope. It used to be that I would go on a diet and I'd lose some weight and then I would reward myself with food or stop working out or start overeating again or start eating the foods that weren't so good for me again and the weight would come back up. I was tired. I had no extra oomph. I didn't have much hope. I gave up. I'll wait till next Monday. Ah, I'll start January 1st. Proof? Weight loss surgery works? That went away. It was always like a super energizer push turbo button that was like, you can do this. It's not over. You're not giving up. You had weight loss surgery. You have a tool. You didn't have this tool before. You can do this. Mental shift, light switch, flipping on, I don't know. But I could make the next best choice the next time I had to make a choice. I could even start over tomorrow if I didn't want to start over right now. But no more wait until Monday. No more waiting until January 1st. Right now. Tomorrow. That's proof weight loss surgery works to me. Next question. How did your surgery work for you? I have a lap band. It's over the top part of my stomach. It helped me to realize a sense of satiety that I had enough. I was given those rules. Operating guide, if you will. Follow them. Use them. Do them. Be successful. Don't. Don't be successful. I wanted to be successful. I changed my life. Started eating different foods. Started exercising regularly. Started eliminating high calorie, high fat, highly carbonated beverages and reaching for water. Started eating protein first and really realizing what protein first meant for me. I already took daily vitamins so that wasn't too new but realized why I was taking the vitamins instead of you need to take your vitamins. You really need to take your vitamins. It gave me a chance to work on me. 100% dedication to being my best me. That's what my surgery did for me. 70% me here, mental for choices, for food, and for exercise. 30% my lap band. In what ways has your life changed? Physically and mentally. Well, the obvious. Physically, I've shed over 130 pounds since my highest weight. I've reduced my size. I was at one point a size 22. Today, I can fit into a 2, a 4, a 6, depending on what I'm wearing. I used to be a 2XL shirt. Now I'm a small or an extra small. I have a figure eight shape Coca-Cola bottle, I've been told. I no longer feel the physical pressure of my weight on my body. I'm not puffy and swollen. My knees don't hurt. My back doesn't hurt. I've became a runner. I went from a couch potato to a, a marathon runner, a triathlete, a P90X graduate. I have no fear. I know I can do it. All I have to do is try. That's mental. Mentally, it gave me the strength to dig deep down inside and truly look and evaluate what was going on. 
It gave me the opportunity to get rid of my excuse, my weight. I can't do that because I won't look good in that. They won't like the fat girl. Everybody wants the skinny girl. I got rid of that. It's me. This girl. They want me. This girl. I like me. This girl. It allowed me to wake up every day liking what I see in the mirror. Respecting myself. A hundred percent. Working always to be my best. Instead of, eh, I don't have to do that today. No, I have to do that today. Lots physical and mental. Did you expect to be who you are today? Hmm. Tricky question. Tricky question. I watched a post-op video, seven days post-op. I was talking about fitness. I was talking about how I'd gone, walked one direction 15 minutes and another direction back 15 minutes. And it hurt my stomach that day. It was a little too much. But the piece of paper I was given told me I was going to have to exercise 210 minutes a week to be successful. And that I didn't really exercise a whole lot when I was overweight, but I liked it when I did, if my foot didn't hurt. My foot doesn't hurt anymore. I love to exercise. Did I think that 210 minutes of exercise a day would turn into training for my second marathon? Never. Did I think that it would lead me to owning and operating a bariatric business? Never. Did I think it would lead me to being a bariatric coach? Nope. Did I think it would lead me to this proof weight loss surgery works? I had hope. I had a lot of hope. So anyway, each day, each week, each month, and each year that passes allows me to keep believing I'm proof weight loss surgery works. What about you? Make us a response video. Thanks for watching. You can be proof weight loss surgery works. It's all about you. What do you want it to be? What does it mean to you? Thanks for watching.